Dada hit the lead, uh, runners dispatch from the 1900 metre mark and Tangero hopped away beautifully today. Kitty's Destiny, 32 Squadron as the White Blinkers goes off to lead them. At the rail, Shimmering Brook, Ricochet Flyers got the green cap. Royal Lance is the trailer, racing six or seven lengths off the leader. 32 Squadron is controlling the pace. Kitty's Destiny, Sanjero's at the rail. Ricochet Flyers a little bit strong in the green. Two lengths away to Shimmering Brook and Royal Lance the trailer. Eight lengths off the leader as 32 Quadrant takes him along. A length and a quarter to the 1200 they go. Kitty's Destiny second. Two lengths Tangero. Ricochet Flyers fourth. In then comes Shimmering Brook and Royal Lance is on the outside. Approaching the 1,000 metre mark and 32 Squadron continues to lead it. Kitty's Destiny is second, then Tangero. Ricochet Flyer continues to fight. Shimmering Brook on the outside. Royal Lance starting to pass them. They move towards the 600 metre region and it's still 32 Squadron. Kitty's Destiny second, Tangero and Shimmering Brook. Not much between the two. Royal Lance on the outside and Ricochet Flyer can throw a blanket over the field as they turn for home. And it's 32 Squadron. Kitty's Destiny moves in. Down the inside, Tangero. Towards the outside, Shimmering Brook. It's still 32 Squadron. Kitty's Destiny. Tangero's on the inside and Ricochet Flyer. 32 Squadron finds more though. And it's 32 Squadron from Tangero and Kitty's Destiny, but 32 Squadron continuing on, and 32 Squadron's going strongly and will win. 32 Squadron by three. Tangero's going to come out second best. Third place, Kitty's Destiny, about six lengths, Ricochet Fly and Royal Arms. Shimmering Brook last. Number four, 32 Squadron, the AP Arrow, Charles Laird, Lyle Hewitson took the lead shortly after the start, claimed the four kilos and skipped away from the opposition. Challenges came from Kitty's Destiny and on the inside Tangero, but outside the 200 it could be seen they weren't going to get to 32 Squadron. Third win from 15 outings and also third win on the poly and went off a win six round ten. Run it across for second, goes to number five, the toad favourite, Tangero, third to Kitty's Destiny. And then it's many lengths back to Ricochet Fly, who was strong in the race. Many lengths back, and then Royal Lance. It's close though, but I think Ricochet Fly might just hold forth, Royal Lance, and Shimmering Brook, obviously something amiss has tailed off. So yeah, the horse with the white blinkers, 32 Squadron, the AP Arrow, Samuel Stud and the Fire Racing Trust. Hopefully this will lift uh, Mickey Goss as well. And here is 32 Squadron going on with the blue cap to win it well under Lyle Hewitson. Tote favourite is number five until race six. Back to the studio. Bred by the Summer Hill Stud, Mickey Goss and the team, the son of AP Arrow from the Charles Laird Stables, come good this evening with Lyle Hudson aboard in a small field. It was always going to be the tactics to have him up there. I think you know the claim for obviously helped him a bit, and um, he's a, he gallops. He's also he, he loves the poly and he loves the front, and he was overdue for a win. When they swung for home, uh, Lyle was just keeping him together, and when he let him rip, that was it. You know, he's, he's a. Lalzi, he's got the experience as well, and I mean, he just let him slide. And well done, team. Well done, Mr. Laird, and well done, Twelish. Super. Thank you. Let's get Lal Hurtson. We keep singing the praises, and the guys must just continue to follow you until you get beat worth that 4 kgs. Take us through this ride. Um, first of all, so I just want to say a big thank you to Mr. Laird, uh, to Lorenzo and the whole team, and also to Mr. Marcus. He, he helped me out with the perfect, uh, perfect instructions, and it went uh, exactly as planned. Uh, we jumped out, and... I got where I wanted to be up in front and he does go but and he came back to me and relaxed very well and going through the 700 I just started to pick it up and as we straightened up and we balanced out uh, I got on my bike and we got away and it was a, a very courageous victory. 
This is like one of those dreams you don't want to wake up from. The hits just keep coming. Yes, sir. No, it's going very well. And uh, please, God, long may I continue. Keep up the hard work. Thank you very much, sir. Let's get a lesh into the picture. Now, when he comes to the course, we've seen the exit here form and the bold inspiration. You must have been quietly confident. Yeah, definitely. The weight, you could not go against the sauce. And I want to say well done to Lyle. He, he rode to perfection. He gave him the instruction and he was in the period and he was confident he'll win the race. And I want to say well done to Charles is in Joburg, the sales. And I want to say Anton Marcus, sorry, because he wanted to ride the Zos, we said one part, and then we, we changed, we wanted to put him in Shivering Brook, and he said the Polytech was not good enough, but we said let's take a chance. Well, enjoy the victory and go get the stake check. Sure, thank you very much. Well done to Lesh Nadu, 32 Squadron, the Fire Racing Trust. The value in the race, he quickened up down the lane, and Lal Hurtson at it again.